Well, another revenue raiser is dancing into the spotlight tonight. A local strip club challenging a state tax exemption when it comes to new dancing, taking its fight to New York's highest court. Jerry Gretzinger live tonight in downtown Albany with more on that story. Jerry. Hey, no, Dory, it's not every day that justices in the Court of Appeals are discussing things like lap dances and pole dances, but today they were discussing exactly those things. Night Moves, the Gentleman's Club in Latham, is seeking to recoup hundreds of thousands of taxes already paid on admissions to the club, as well as taxes that were paid on private lap dances. There's a state law, that, a tax law, that grants exemptions to places that offer live art performances, dance included. So today, counsel for both sides presented their arguments on whether a pole dance or a lap dance can be considered a choreographed artistic performance. Some people would say by its very nature, uh, it's kind of uh, low class, low brow, uh, and therefore, uh, no matter how hard they practice and how hard they train, um, they don't qualify. Um, we say, hey, you know, we are in fact an art form. Certainly a tax auditor who probably is a CPA, but probably has never seen a dance performance of this type before, he doesn't get to walk in and say, I don't like this. And that's exactly what they've been doing. Your Honor, even if these are considered choreographed performances, these charges are still taxable. And I would like to start with F3 okay. because um, Petitioner is a cabaret or similar place. The charges of a cabaret or similar place are taxable if the establishment's sale of refreshments are more than merely incidental. I'll explain what that second attorney was discussing there. The reason they're talking about beverage sales is because Night Moves does not sell alcohol. Typically, an establishment that does and relies on sales of beverages, there will be an entirely different tax category. But they do not sell alcohol, so that's another reason why they haven't had to pay taxes or believe they shouldn't have to pay taxes. So uh, the council is also trying to discuss the whole beverage issue. However, everyone waiting now for the answer to the big question, which will come in several weeks or months, is that lap dance a work of art? We're all waiting to find out. We're live in Albany. Jerry Gretzinger, CBS 6 News.